Hey everyone, Daniel from Blog Quarter here. And in today's FlowLab tutorial, I'm going to show you how to upload a game asset and put it into your game. So uh, here we go. Now the first thing we got to do is get a game asset. So you can either pay for one or you can get one for free. Uh, there's two sites that I know of. Um, this Kenny dot n l k e n n e y dot n l and you can get free game assets here just click assets uh, select 2d 3d whatever you're looking for we're making a 2d game um, so I'm gonna make a character here I'll upload a character for this tutorial so here's the tune characters we're gonna download uh, choose to donate which would be really cool I wish I wasn't so broke I would but uh, you don't you also don't have to credit uh, this website in your game but that would be kind of greasy not to <laughs> so you might as well just put a link to his game or mention them somewhere or don't it's up to you okay that's downloaded so before we can put it into the game we just got to get it out of this zip file so go to downloads I'll open it up um, zombie for sure take the PNG poses um, we just want a neutral pose idle there we go that took me quite a while okay there it is so I'm just going to save this into downloads and I'm just going to say yeah characters on the idle okay so now that's in our downloads not as a file but just the character so now I'm just going to upload that character oops we need a transparent background oh this is, does have a transparent background if it didn't if you're getting an asset that didn't have a transparent background this one does um, go here Lunapic this website here www.lunapic.com and you can make your um, images transparent here but we don't have that's just a side note we don't have to do that here and um, actually before we move on here's another website to get game assets from uh, it's called craftpicks.net and just click on freebies and then you can scroll through whatever you're looking for backgrounds objects characters uh, you can find it there but uh, here we are back in flow lab with the game world so we're gonna left click create uh, just name a zombie character and then just click edit sprite and then in here you just simply upload choose file Oops. yeah downloads there he is click OK and put them in your game here he is uh, if you didn't want them that size before you upload them download them first but before you upload them just resize them in a canvas go to paint even just go to paint on your Microsoft computer resize them or there's a few other sites but yeah resize them if you're not happy with the size uh, and that will be the end of this tutorial of how to upload a character or object, a game asset, into FlowLab. Thanks for watching.